At our next topic is distance formula. So, ganina itong first topic, di ba, is distance formula between two points. Now, this time, now, this time, we have distance from a point to a line, and we have distance between parallel lines. So, kaning distance from a point to a line, si, for example, mo ni point, mo ni mo hang line, kana na distance na ginapertain is kani. Ang perpendicular distance. Okay? So, you have this formula, ax plus by plus c over square root of a squared plus b squared. So, unsaon na siya paggamit. Say, for example, uh, kanina uh, line, yung equation is 9x plus y is equal to 3. Say, for example, so, kaning a, b, c, mauna siya ang gikan sa line. So, what is your a? C9. What is your b? C1. What is your c? 3 or negative 3? Answer is negative 3 dapat. Kaya nga naman, this must follow, uh, kani siya, this, this must follow the general equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0. So, dapat ang c, again, naapod siya sa left side sa equation. Together with your x and y. Okay? So, dapat nakatranspose ni siya sa pika. So, c is negative 3. So, what is x and y? Man siya ang coordinates ani na point. Okay? And if ever man class, nag-negative in yung answer pag-solve, just disregard the negative sign. Okay? Just take the absolute value. Now, next we have distance between parallel lines. So, same lang gihapon class. Si A yung si B. A is the coefficient of X. B is the coefficient of Y. And, uh, siyempre, since M1 is equal to M2, diba? Pag parallel lines. And then finally, you have C2 and C1. Okay, kanang C2 C1 mo ng constant terms sa so ka line. Okay? So, again, if mag-negative ang answer, just disregard the negative sign. So, solve tag 3 sample problems para mas masabtan. You have number 1. What is the distance between the line x plus 2y plus x plus 2y is equal to negative 8 and the point 5, negative 2. So, d is equal to Okay, mo formula. So, what is our A? A is what? 1. Okay. B is what? 2. C is what? Dapat ang negative 8 nakatranspose sa pika. So, dapat positive 8. What is X? X is 5. What is Y? Negative 2. Tama? So, this should be 1 times 5 plus 2 times negative 2 plus 8 all over square root of 1 squared plus 2 squared. Therefore, the distance is 4.02 class. Next, number 2. Find the distance between the points 0, 8 and the line 6x equal to y. Sige. Um, same lang yapon. D is equal to ax plus by plus c all over square root of a squared plus b squared ta class. So, we have, um, what is our a? a is 6. What is our b? Dapat negative 1. Okay? Kaya nga naman, diba, dapat ax plus by plus c ang atong ginafollow na format. So, dapat ang y, katranspose pa sa pika. So, may mo siyang negative y. So, b is negative 1. c is what? 0. What is x? 0 niha. What is x? 0. What is y? 8. Therefore, we have distance equal to 6 times 0 minus 1. I'm sorry. Plus negative 1 times 8 plus 0 all over square root of 6 squared plus negative 1 squared. Answer is 1.32 class. And again, pag mag negative lagi ang answer, disregard the negative sign. Just take the absolute value. Okay, so last problem for this topic. You have number 3. Find the distance between the lines 3x plus y minus 12 is equal to 0 and 3x plus y equal to 4. Sige, so distance between two parallel lines ni siya class. Distance is what? C2 minus C1 over square root of A squared plus B squared. Sige, um... 
let's say diretso na taha you have negative 12 minus transpose of pika so negative 4 over square root of 3 squared plus uh, 1 squared answer is 2.53 so nato lang so ang kanina topic is as long as you know the formula diretso lang siya substitute Okay, basta importante is kabalo mo sa formula. And, careful lang mo sa kanang kan pag-transpose, ha? Sa labi na sa kani. Labi na ane. Wait. Labi na sa C na part, sa constant na term. Again, ha? Dapat, kani ang ginafollow, ang general equation. Okay, so proceed sa itong next topic.